This local sports report is presented by the Guelph Minor Lacrosse Association, providing a memorable experience for players in all age divisions. Come out this summer and cheer on the Regals at home and on the road. Learn more about their box and field programs by visiting GuelphRegalsLacrosse.com. Let's head to the West End Rec Center in Guelph for U9 Lacrosse, the hometown Guelph Regals on home floor. They would face off with the Cambridge Highlanders on Tuesday night. Jumping into the action is the Regal striking first on this play. Bo Hendricks picks it up out front and sends it home. So it's 1-0 Guelph. A good start for the Regals and they keep the pressure coming. Carter Atkinson bounces a shot on net from distance and Carter's got a goal. So it's 2-0 Regals. And Guelph wouldn't stop there. This is Edison Grovem on the run. He's a step ahead of the defense and he shoots and Edison scores. So the Regals are at three. And it wouldn't be long before they'd make it four. It's a great pass from Bo Hendricks. He headmans it to Ryan Verdun and Ryan charges the net and it's top cheese from Ryan. So it's four nothing Guelph. Late in the period now and how about Ashton Hins? He speeds it on net, spins off a defender and buries it. So the Regals make it five heading to the second. Jumping to the second period now, and it's more Regal's offense. Callum Arbuckle aims low, and he finds the goal mesh. So the Regals are at six. Moments later now, and this is Ashton Hins back on the rush, looking for his second of the game. He just misses, but look out for the rebound. Ben Styles is out front, and he scores it. So it's seven nothing. And later in the period, and how about number eight for the Regals? Jackson Kirby lobs one in from distance, and the Regals are rolling. Still in the second, and watch the control from Landon O'Connor. He picks it up off the wall and charges the net. Landon shoots and he scores. And it's nine for Guelph. The Regals getting the whole team involved and later in the frame, it's James McMillan getting on the board. He beats the goalie and it's 10 for Guelph. The Highlander's still battling hard and it's a great chance for Harvey on a fry chuck to get on the board. He steps around the defense and shoots and the Highlanders are on the board. So it's 10-1 Regals. Jumping to the third period, now 12-1 Regals and it's more from Harvey on a fry chuck. He speeds in and scores, and the Highlanders make it two for themselves. The Regals back the other way, and it's a great pass from Ben Stiles. He sends it to George Sampson, and George sends it home. So it's 13 for the Regals. Landon O'Connor takes out Sampson with a tackle Selly, and the Regals cruise to a win. They take it over the Cambridge Highlanders by a final score of 15-2 on Tuesday night.